Generation of Lights Festival. Good evening. How many of you are excited to see Santa tonight? The Batavia Community Band's excited. What about you out there? I think the band's louder. Who is louder? Batavia Community Band? Are those of you out there that are going to go see Santa tonight? from the North Pole. He's got a special message to come down here to the Batavia Riverwalk tonight. And just so you know, there are free wagon rides just to the right of the main stage over there. So head on over at any time. If you brought a canned good, Batavia Food Pantry is here to collect those. So please, if you want a free wagon ride, head on over. We also have free popcorn. So if you notice, there's a theme tonight. Free, free, free. Woo! <laughs> Uh, there are also holiday craft activities inside the city council chambers. So for those of you that don't know, that's right across the street in the beautiful government building. It's on the south end. And free craft activities for everyone. And heat, in case you get a little too cold. We also have Christmas Tree Lane featuring 25 Christmas trees throughout the Riverwalk. So head on out and you can see 25 trees decorated by local organizations and later tonight we're going to announce people's choice award and uh, that were voted for by facebook fans and you can stop by the batavia depot museum uh, to warm up and all sorts of good things happening tonight in just a couple minutes the batavia community band led by conductor john heath We'll have some pre-programming music for you, for your listening pleasure. So let's give a warm welcome to the Batavia Community Band.
ladies and gentlemen, let's give it up for the Batavia Community Band! There's nothing better than the Batavia Community Band to get you into the holiday spirit. Welcome everyone. Let's give a nice big hooray for Santa so he can hear us from the North Pole to make sure he's on our way, on his way. All right, we just want to make sure Santa can hear us. So let's do it a little bit louder, but this time on the count of three. All right, we're going to say Batavia, just so he knows it's not Geneva, it's not St. Charles, it's here in Batavia he needs to come, okay? So on the count of three, yell Batavia as loud as you can, okay? One, two, three. Batavia! All right, we'll see you around 5.30 if he's been listening or if his elves have told him that we're right here. There's so much happening tonight. I want to welcome, welcome you to the Celebration of Lights Festival brought to you by the City of Batavia, Batavia Park District, and Photos Tensorial Parlor. And much thanks to the Batavia Community Band. They're always looking for new talent. So please make sure you talk to John Heath, the conductor. He's ready for you anytime. And you too could be up on stage as soon as next year. Haha. Uh -huh. Dun dun dun, right? <laughs> All right, we have free wagon rides tonight. And uh, we also have the Batavia Interfaith Food Pantry here. If you have a food donation, you can also donate that to get your free wagon ride. We also have free popcorn. We have free crafts over at the Batavia City Council Chambers. But now, without further ado, it is my great pleasure to introduce to you one of my favorite people in Batavia, let's give a warm Batavia welcome to Mr. Craig Fotos, Master of Ceremonies tonight. And Craig is the owner of Fotos Tensorial Parlor and also the mastermind behind the Peace on Earth Bridge. Let's give it up again for Craig. Thank you, Allison. And I just think this band is so outstanding. I went to Batavia and I was telling Mr. Styers. Had I paid a little more attention, I could have been in that band. I didn't know it was so much fun. So if you get a chance and you want to play for this band, you talk to these guys because they always need more people playing. And Allison was talking about it because Santa, we just got off the phone with him. Google Earth isn't working. So he cannot find where to find Batavia. So we have to have one more loud Batavia yell. And if he can't find it, I don't know if we're going to have any presents this year. So can we do it one more time? And Allison's going to lead us with one, two, and three, and then Batavia. Count with me. One, two, three. What's that? Santa heard that one? Okay. So... Thank you very, very much. And thank the Park District for this and the city for allowing us to have this wonderful opportunity to all gather. So we're going to start out with the Batavia Band playing a rousing jingle bells. But if you'd like to sing and you're a young person, come on up here because we need help up here. Come on. Come on up to the stage right here. Come on. Yay. Right down here, up in front. There we go. I need you guys. If you're going to be up here with me, I need you to really sing loud, okay? And I'm going to put the microphone in front of you. And what does that mean? Sing even louder, doesn't it? Did you want... Come on over here, guys. Come on over here, everybody over here. And we are, this is your first chance maybe to sing some Christmas carols to the whole town of Batavia. And so let's do a really good loud job. Come on over here. We're going to have a few more of you over here. And Mr. Maestro, do you want to? Okay, and let me know when we're ready.
band is so good, my goodness gracious. And you guys, the best group we've ever had. So, but we got to sing a little louder. We're ready whenever you are, sir. Oh, Rudolph is one of my favorites. You guys know the one with Rudolph? You know the words? One note. Gotcha. St. Nicholas, you guys up for that one? One verse. Okay, who's ready for Jolly Old St. Nicholas? Wow. Oh, yeah. He 
was going to be a lot more jolly here. Yes. Yes. to moms and dads because now we're going to have the mayor of our fine fair city i don't know if you've ever heard of him before he was just elected first time first this is mayor shelke it's my proud privilege to introduce him to the very fine town of a team let's have a big round of applause for the mayor <laughs> thank you mayor i'll be right up Well, on behalf of the community of Batavia, I want to officially welcome everyone here tonight. And I want to officially welcome everybody here tonight and thank each and every one of you for coming. Uh, as most of you remember, last year we could not get to do this. And we ended up uh, doing it kind of in the dark, and then we showed a video of it later. So we didn't have the opportunity to bring everybody from Batavia together. And that's what really, this is what makes this a real great moment because one of the things in the world that we live in, the support and the love and the friendship and the understanding that so many people in Batavia share with each other and put into their lives, we want to amplify that and bring it out for the whole world to see. And I think the Christmas time is a great time for Batavia to show the world how really great a community we really do live in. Thanks to each and every one of you and your spirits and beliefs and going forward to make this world a great place for future generations to have and to have this be something that uh, 30 years from now, the kids that are here will be parents and they'll be able to bring their children down here and have this memory of this memorable time. Will we be here, Mayor? Will we be here at that time in 30 years? I'm sure you will be. I think you will be too, sir. So, on behalf of the community again, thank you all for coming. Uh, I want to thank uh, John Heath and the Batavia Community Band for their great efforts. Uh, they continue to uh, show us what a great talent that we have within our community. And I think they illustrate the kinds of people that we have living in our town who are willing to step forward and just volunteer their time and talents and services to do some stuff that really supports the Batavia community in a very special way. So as I say, this is a community made up of very wondrous and special people who share their love and their support and their understanding to each other on a day-to-day -day basis, and that's what makes our world such a great place to live. And I am told that any moment here now, fire trucks should arrive with Santa Claus, is that right? Okay. We got we got to land them and then get them down Wilson Street to the traffic. Uh, so uh, as a result of that, I think they're maybe coming down the street now. All right, here they come on the Batavia Fire Department ladder truck. So can everybody yell, Santa, Santa, Santa. So here's where you're at. Santa! Santa, Santa, Santa! Santa!
Did you get the cookies we left out for you? Of course. You like when these kids leave milk and cookies out, don't you? Absolutely. Chocolate or vanilla? What kind of, or white milk? White milk with sugar cookies. Oh, man. You guys know what's going on. Allison, I want to turn this over to you and the mayor. Don't we have the countdown now? We sure do. How many of you are ready to turn on the community Christmas tree right over there behind you? The mayor's going to do a countdown from 10 down to 1, okay? So make sure you count down with him. Okay, I'll turn around. Well, first, on behalf of the community, I want to officially welcome Sam Scarlett, to Scarlett, stay with and uh, thank you to everyone who will be joining in on the countdown. So Santa's going to throw the switch here, and, and we're going to light the community tree, which is right over there. And we're all going to count down together so that we get it loud and clear that we want the tree lit for the Christmas season. So Santa, let's begin by 10, 9, to have Santa come to Batavia. You think we can get you to come back next year too? Absolutely. I missed you last year so much. We missed you too, but we're all glad. Where does Santa go now? Is he going to... Peg, if you'd like to see Santa, he's going to be in the Peg Bond Center right behind us. And you guys can find out, and you can tell Santa what you might, if you've been a good boy or good girl, and if you might want to, like, talk to him about something you might want to see from Santa Claus. Okay, so let's give Santa a big hoorah, and then we'll send him on his way. Hoorah! There aren't enough hoorahs in the world. Thank you, Santa. Those of you that may want to get mine for Santa, there may be those of you that want to get mine for a wagon ride, and there may be some of you that are here to learn a little bit more about the winning Christmas trees around the Christmas tree lane. So we're excited. Can we have a drum roll? All right. First, we have to thank our sponsor, Raising Cane. Number one, the People's Choice Award. And it's a darn good one. Number 13, the Kiwanis Club of Batavia. Number two, the Best Holiday Spirit. Number 23, the HC Storm Brownies and Daisy Troop. And number three, the most original. Number 17, the AGS Club Scout Pack 103. But you know, everybody that participates is a winner with me. They're all winners, and this community is a winner, and this band, I can't tell you enough, because you guys outdo yourselves every year, and I know that it's been some years it's kind of hard when it's like five below zero, but I would like the audience to give a big round of applause one more time to Batavia's own band. Stand up. Thank you, band. 
everyone. And we'll see you next year. There's so much going on. Feel free to head on over to the wagon rides. Head over to Santa. Free crafts over at the city council chambers. Enjoy the night. Thank <laughs> you.